What's up, data people? My name is Matthew Heffron, and today we're going to talk about bar charts in Metabase. So let's jump right into it. So the first thing we're going to do is go to new question, then we're going to click on the orders table, and then we'll come down to summarize, pick the metric you want to see. We're going to say sum of total, and then we'll go over to pick column to group by, and we will go down to product and then category. Go ahead and hit preview. We can look at that looks good so let's visualize it so there we have our simple bar chart you can see it, the categories down here but say i want to edit this a little bit what options do we have so we'll go to settings and you can see here we have sum of total i can click the ellipses i can change this here let's change it to a currency we'll come over here to style let's go ahead and just call this total and we'll change the color Perfect. So now when I hover, you can see in the tooltip, it just says total and we're seeing it as a currency. Perfect. Let's keep going. If we go to display, we can set a goal line. We can show values on the data points, on the axes. We can hide, show them, change the labels. You have some additional options like the scale and show lines and marks. So very similar to the line chart. So let's go ahead and go back. And one thing you'll notice is that we don't have a stack bar chart. So how do we get to a stack bar chart? So basically we just have to update the data. So if we come in here and we go to summarize, we can hit the plus button. Let's go create it at, and let's look at this by year. We're gonna visualize this data again. And you can see by default, it changes it to a line, but we wanna see this as a stack bar. So we can go to visualization, we can go to bar. And now when we go to this display, you'll see that we have the options for don't stack, stack and stack to 100%. So we'll go ahead and click on stack. And just like that, now we have a stacked bar chart. And then let's go back one more time and look at this row. So this is, a horizontal bar chart, they call it a row chart, but they recently they made an update. So all the options that we have on the bar, you can do on the horizontal bar charts. So if we come in here, you can see we have all the same settings. So that was the quick rundown of bar charts. Hope that helped. If these are helpful, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.